hi guys welcome back again to my channel so today guys we'll be talking about animacoli and two-faced edibia but before we dive right into the topic if you're seeing me for the very first time hi please do well to hit on the subscribe button and subscribe to the channel and turn on your bell notification and for my returning subscribers hello thank you so much for coming back to watch my videos and please let's make this video very interactive because there's something that actually baffles me a whole lot in what is actually happening at the moment okay for those of you who do not know two-faced dibia and anima collie two-faced dibia is an a-list musician here in nigeria who came into limelight in the 2000s or early 2000s or something like that you get and then he blew up completely around 2002 or between 2000 and 2004 i really cannot tell at the moment where he sang the african queen and of course Annie Dibia was his then has always been his girlfriend who was also like a video vaccine in that particular African queen um, music that blew him up completely you understand so yeah and for the longest time that we have known to face Dibia and Annie Macaulay's story there has always been a woman and there has always been children like two Face was still dating Annie. Two Face was still with Annie. They've still they've been together from a very young age. You get and before he even got mar married to Annie, he had like five children on his side. You get from different baby mamas. So there's a video actually going off on social media, like since day before yesterday of or yesterday of um Two Face talking about um, um, mon mon um monogamy, polygamy, cheating, blah blah blah, and all that. Let me just leave you guys to watch the video, and then I will come back to give you people. My two naira fifty kubo opinion. Men are wired like that. A man would love a woman to hell. Hundred percent. Or maybe he's somewhere. Yeah. His dick would just decide something. No, he's mine. Not his dick. It's not his own entity. How you look at him? He will yeah. fuck. Even if he's married. But he will not even give a fuck about that person. He just wants. So to is that us? Yeah. Are you talking about general? Or you're talking about yourself. That's what is you're this what you, you believe? Or you're talking about? It's what I believe. But is that wow. you? Or is that belief? So, what are your opinions? In that video, you hear to face saying that oh, a man can love a woman to the moon and back and still have an affair outside. He can oh be dying for the woman and still uh, like he can be he, he's like like he is trying to justify the fact that his his dick has a different opinion from what his head is actually thinking. <laughs> not if it's not good. Like there's nothing somebody will not actually see on this social media you get but in my own opinion i just feel like he's just trying to justify his indiscipline his disrespect and his cheating attitude and yet yeah, that we have known about two face for the longest time like since i ever knew myself properly i've known two face with several women and different stories with his name together in one place you understand but you know one thing that baffles me so much i feel like annie edibia getting married to two face he, she should have been able to to like get used to this because you know what you when people just show you who they are i feel like you should accept them for who they are i feel like annie dibia marrying two face is a decision she has made knowing that this bag and baggages is coming with her like this is actually going to be his lifestyle for as long as they are alive because guess what all the things he has done all the children he has with other women annie dibia was still in the picture so this is something that he has been doing for a back to back to back to back to back and you know if he could not change when they were dating or if he could not respect her when they were dating you saw all this and you decided to marry the guy so i feel like you know in that in that in that video you see that you know that Ari, annie is really pained no wife won't be pained there's no wife under the sun that won't really feel the hurt. No matter how we are trying to say that, oh, she is supposed to accept it and move on with it. Blah, blah. No wife would want to see a wife who, who, who feels like she's into a monogamous kind of relationship with her husband. Seeing her husband or hearing that her husband is having an affair with someone outside. Maybe when they were dating was a different ball game altogether. But now that we are both committed to each other, there should have there should have been some level of adjustment or some level of change from the part of two fifty there. But obviously, like the old saying that a snake can never change. You understand? He only he only peels off its skin, but it comes back to what it truly is. You understand? He can never change from who he really is. So I do not blame even though you see the pain and the grieving and his expression asking him that ah, are you trying to talk for other men or you're trying to talk for yourself? You get she's really pained, but I feel like she should know that this is what she has always been and yes with the online in me i do not feel really cool about the whole scenario i feel like two-faced dibia has been doing this since when they were dating i was thinking that it was about time where he can respect the girl and to be really honest with you he looks really really nice 
when he wasn't even saying the period when he wasn't even saying anything maybe he was saying nothing they happened or no shaking or whatever exclamation he likes to say you understand but him now rubbing it in on his wife is really really disgusting and annoying to say the least you understand because i feel like he would have avoided that question as much as possible there was really no need for him to answer that question there was really no need for him to talk about or explain himself to whoever was actually asking him that particular picture because you know how much this thing would definitely hurt your wife you saying it and you have the guts to be saying that oh you can love your wife and just say, who does that i do not want to believe that you can love your wife and you know we all justify the reason why a man should cheat why a man should be having an affair even some women a lot of women are accepting the fact that oh he's a man a man can never be loyal says who lack of discipline that makes a man to cheat is like the height of indiscipline in a man that exhibits that because a man that will sound like that he's not even ready to change in the first place he's not even ready to adjust how he's acting like i don't feel like he's feeling remorse saying such thing he's like my brain can be thinking about you but my thing is thinking about the woman i'm seeing at the moment hey like seriously eh I feel pain for Anya as much as we really would have loved her to get past that stage of hurt. But I see myself as a wife. I feel really pain for her. But obviously, it is it is what she actually accepted when she got married. Because yeah, she had a child for him when they were not married. Other people had children for him when they were not married. They were still dating. And then when she got married, she now gave birth to another child. And you can see he's not even changing because you keep hearing rumors of things that has been happen happening. Maybe there's been no baby at the moment. But you guys, Two Face is not even ready to change. And to tell you the truth, this is what and he actually saw and she still got married to him because i feel like the only solution to it would have been maybe you're not getting married to it if you knew you cannot bear the heat don't be in the kitchen if you know you cannot bear the heat of what he's doing because it doesn't look like he's going to change anytime soon then you shouldn't have get, gotten yourself involved and my only advice for her is maybe you just get to be used to it and do not let it hurt you the way i saw it hurting her in that particular video so the face is actually not, not ready to change and annie should just maybe try it's, it's difficult it's easier said than done but try but to be really honest it is disgusting seeing the way two Face was actually talking about it like hearing the way he was conversing about it like the audacity like the audacity geez on the more people are really going through a lot and i do not pray to ever find myself in that type of situation because it will not be funny it will not be funny because i know the hurt the embarrassment that that lady is actually feeling seated down there and to think that the husband would have respected her and not even answer such questions but there he was there trying to justify the rubbish he's been doing with some flimsy um excuse of his brain is thinking left his dick is thinking right please that's not an excuse if you want to change i feel like if you want to change you can change you can decide to be disciplined and faithful to your one so what's your opinion about that video that's been going around what do you think about the annie and to face the dpr relationship please leave it in the comment section and what do you think about my opinion i want to hear in the comment section thank you so very much guys for watching i hope you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up and leave me comments of course in the comment section i'll most definitely see you all in my next one bye guys